maybe today is a day when we can just say this is our new normal. You know, we live in a digital world. Um, it's not, you know, all of our previous humility about human nature and the need for institutions and the need for government, but government's not gonna solve all our problems. Like, all of that's back, you know? Let's just be realistic and think about how we can update some of our rules and norms for this new normal, this new age. And I think we have to acknowledge that, you know, Robert Mueller said yesterday that um, we still face a national security threat. Uh, we still face a threat to our elections. Um, we know that our information ecosystem is vulnerable, um, not just to foreign interference, but um, to those who would spread hoaxes and frauds and so on. And the internet, you know, from this decentralized original network where anybody could set up a blog and publish has become quite centralized on a few private platforms. Uh, our news feeds and recommendations are centralized through algorithms that are meant to keep us online. Uh, there's a lack of transparency, transparency being the original value of this internet, that it was gonna bring dramatic, radical transparency to everything we do. There's a lot less transparency um, in terms of the ads that you see, in terms of, you know, is it a bot, is it a human, is it manipulated video, is it a troll, did a click farm put it to the top of trending, uh, users don't have enough control, the local news mo revenue model has been undermined. So I think it's time to just roll up our sleeves and be super practical about the problems that we have and think about them in a system, almost like a cybersecurity framework, um, as opposed to, you know, should the government or platforms be deciding if this content is true or not? I don't think that's a productive, nobody's talking about that, I hope. Uh, what we're ta and nobody's talking about putting the genie back in the bottle anymore. I think this is our new normal and let's just talk about the really practical problems we face and, and how we can address them. Thanks.